Uh, that's not tech. Let's get started. What's up guys, if you are a regular viewer of my channel, you know that I typically put up videos having to do with technology, computers, uh, server builds, that kind of thing. Uh, but this go around I wanted to try something a little bit different. Uh, what we're looking at is a pair of adjustable weights from a company called PowerBlock. And uh, these happen to be the, uh, the model name for these are the U90 Stage 1s. Alright, so why make a video about these? Well, uh, there's a couple of reasons why. Number one, uh, I kind of wanted to test the waters a little bit and see if this is something that you guys might be interested in. Uh, but also, uh, I think that uh, being healthy is really important. And I think just because you might be into tech or you might consider yourself a geek or a nerd like I do, uh, that doesn't mean that uh, you need to be unhealthy. Uh, so uh, I am getting into a little bit more serious um, exercising and I needed some uh, adjustable weights or I needed weights and I decided to get some adjustable weights uh, and I decided on these. The other part of the re the other reason really why I wanted to make this particular video is that I haven't really seen a really good video about these uh, adjustable weights. The ones that I've seen so far are like really grainy or just just really not good. Even the ones that uh, the video that is made by the company PowerBlock is not that great. So I figured I'd take the time, I've got some good lighting, and I'll make a video and I'll show you what these things are all about. So I've taken one of the power blocks and I've kind of put it in pieces so that I can show you how this all works. Now this center piece here uh, accounts for 10 pounds total. Uh, there are some uh, additional uh, weights that are on the inside of this thing that you can take out so you can adjust it uh, down to 5 pounds. Uh, which is just this white box here in the handle if you take out both of the weights and I'll show you that in a second uh, and then each one of those weights is two and a half pounds so you can go five seven and a half or ten uh, for the center section now this lever up on the top is how you remove the um, the weights on the bottom and you can see that this metal plate here um, rotates with that lever and uh, there's uh, two closed positions and one open in the middle and if you want to get those weights out you stick it to the open side and then you get these stainless steel slugs that uh, are each uh, two and a half pounds and on the front side here you've got the um, I guess the cavities where you stick these in okay now this piece here uh, this uh, I've actually removed from the uh, from the weights over here um, there's a little bungee that holds that in place so that's easy to put back. Uh, this little selector tool or indexer might be a good word for it is how you uh, pick the weight that you want. Now on the bottom here we have the different colors that indicate the weights, uh, the weight um, size that you're choosing. And then if I turn this up just a bit you see you've got all these uh, like ridges um, right here. Now that lets you take your selector and uh, these follow those and then help you pick the weights based on the one that you want. Uh, this center section here, uh, these two bars here are padded and the bar or the handle in the middle uh, has like a rubber a rubber grip around it and it's a little it's got a little bit of a contour uh, right here not very severe. I've seen some uh, dumbbells and some free weights that have like a really severe bump in the middle for ergonomics but you know for me this feels um, feels right uh, as far as um, it being comfortable. On the front side we've got some uh, what appear to be like some just maintenance screws or whatever I guess if you need to take this apart for somehow and then on the bottom there's a uh, piece of metal here. This is solid, so that's what's giving you your your weight in addition to the uh, to the plastic. And then on the other side, what I just showed you. So the uh, the metal slugs here. And then if I play around with this um, lever, you can see that there's a you know these metal pieces here that prevent these from falling out when it's in the closed position. So let's pick some weights here. So. Um, like I mentioned before, this metal section or middle section on its own is 10 pounds with those two um, metal slugs in it. And the selector here, now this will have to be 
uh, attached here for safety, but just for ease of display, I guess, I took it off. And you pick the color that corresponds to the weight that you want to pick. Now, in my case, um, because I've selected the black, that's going to give me 20 pounds. Each one of these plates uh, are 10 pounds on their own, plus the 10 that's in the middle section, and you get 20 pounds total. So I can lift these out, and you can see that the weight comes with it. And then if I uh, just progress, this is going to be a little bit harder <laughs> from behind the camera, but you see that two of the plates are selected and that third one stays, and so on. Now, this particular set, uh, and one of the reasons why I really like this particular set here, uh, is expandable up to 90 pounds. There's actually two additional uh, weight packs or additional packs that you can get for this. Um, so this one, as is, goes up to um, 50 pounds total. So the green corresponding to the green here. And you can buy uh, an add-on pack that gets you up to 70, and that's the Stage 2 something pack. I think it's the Expander or whatever. Uh, and then there's a Stage 3 that gets you all the way up to 90. And of course, those will just, um, you know, the weights will be like this. This will sit into the expander, and then you've got, you'll have more colors here that correspond to the weights that you want. Here's an explanation on how this chart works. The middle section here with both of those metal slugs uh, works out to be 10 pounds, and each uh, weight that you select is uh, an additional 10. So if I've got both metal slugs in, 10 pounds in the middle, I'm going to be looking at this bottom row here. So I, I start out uh, with 10. If I select the black section, I'm going to have 20, and then 30, 40, and 50, and so on. If I take one of those slugs out, then the middle section becomes 7.5 pounds, and then I use this middle row of numbers to tell me how much weight I'm going to be selecting. And then if I take both of them out, the middle works out to be 5 pounds, and then I'm using the top row here. Let's take a look at the weights in a little bit more detail. Uh, so this is the first one in the series here. Uh, these are uh, 10 pounds a piece. Uh, I've got a nice uh, like urethane or plastic covering on the outside. The Power Block World's Best Dumbbell logo stickered here. And there's a couple of Allen key screws that you know we wouldn't be doing anything with, but uh, you've got that there. And these bars are um, have to have some kind of metal in it because of that, uh, the magnet that will stick to it. But these are covered as well, and there is some flex here. Now, I wouldn't um, stress these a lot, but I think having some give in this is probably a good thing, uh, especially if you're going to be working out and changing the weights quickly, and there's going to be a lot of movement here when you do that. So having some flex in there is um, probably a really good thing. Now, uh, like I said, these are 10 pounds apiece and you can kind of see on the top here these little um, tabs here that correspond to the bars each one that gets progressively lower and that's how you um, can step up and uh, pick the different kind of weight so you can see if I put this here and then drag this forward and push it up you can see the different steps here but they're all you know 10 pounds each and uh, they feel super solid, they don't feel cheap at all. Um, so I think these are going to work out really well. This middle section here is reversible, so it doesn't really matter what direction you put it in. So it will work that way uh, or that way. And then the selector works the same way, depending, regardless I should say, of which direction this guy is in. So that's a nice feature. And uh, just overall, there's not a lot of moving parts, and that's a really big reason why I decided to go with these power blocks instead of something like the Bowflex Select Tech weights. Um, that just seems like there's so many, um, so many moving parts in that thing, and things that can just go wrong or just not work right overall. Uh, this is really simple. It just, um, you know, you pick the weight that you want, you slide this uh, indexer in, and then away you go. I thought this might be a good angle to show you how the uh, little indexer or selector or whatever we're calling this thing, um, how this works. So you can see uh, the different colors corresponding to the weights that you want to pick. And then these notches, um, at least the ones down here, are for the expandable packs that are going to go uh, over here. And 
the selector comes out and all you do is pick the one that you want slide it down and then take the weight out now this is really easy uh, that uh, magnet make sure that this is not going to come out when you're working out uh, one thing that you need to be mindful of is that you don't do something you know like that which is easy to do um, that might be the only drawback I see with this but you know if you just take a second and just realize that you're um, putting these uh, correctly then you should be fine let's do a little bit of a size comparison so here are the power blocks and underneath is one of these um, hex shaped weights this happens to be 15 pounds uh, obviously um, so if we take the tape measure this is about 12 inches give or take uh, a little bit more than 12 inches this weight down here is more like 10 and change and you can see that these aren't uh, that much bigger at least lengthwise if I move this out the way and roll over this guy now these are some cast iron uh, weights and uh, these adjustable ones that you can screw in here and these are actually uh, lengthwise happen to be a little bit bigger than this guy so this is 20 pounds and this is about uh, got 13 14 inches something like that so uh, at least from the width way uh, these are actually a little bit more compact and that's one of the reasons why um, one of the many, many reasons why I wanted to get this particular guy because uh, it just wasn't very large and uh, it's gonna take up not a ton of space on uh, uh, in my little workout area all right guys that's pretty much gonna wrap up the video here I'm really really interested in what you guys think leave me a comment below uh, I know this is a little bit outside of my comfort zone as far as what we do on the channel uh, but let me know if you want to see more of this not necessarily uh, like weightlifting uh, workout type stuff but just uh, non-tech stuff um, let me know uh, I'm like I said I'm, I'm really interested um, you know as far as the power blocks go I'm really excited to get going um, on using these in uh, some of the workouts that I'm going to be doing. I think these are going to work out really well. Now, uh, for people who are watching this because they wanted to see power blocks, I'm hoping I did you guys a little uh, justice here. Uh, a lot of the videos that I've seen, like I said, are you know not not great I guess um, so hopefully this will help you guys make a decision on wanting to get something like this they're not cheap there's uh, about four hundred dollars but if you break this down from uh, trying to replicate this with free weights you know you're gonna save a lot of money doing it that way so uh, thank you guys so much for checking the video out like share subscribe comment for sure and uh, that's it guys check out the description also for places where I'm at Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. Uh, that's not tech. Let's get started. What's up, guys? If you are a regular viewer of my channel, you know that I typically put up videos having to do with technology, computers, uh, server builds that kind of thing uh, but this go around I wanted to try something a little bit different uh, what we're looking at is a pair of adjustable weights from a company called power block and uh, these happen to be the uh, the model name for these are the u90 stage ones alright so why make a video about these well uh, there's a couple of reasons why number one uh, I kinda wanted to test the waters a little bit and see if this is something that you guys might be interested in uh, but also uh, I think that uh, being healthy is really important and I think just because you might be into tech or you might consider yourself a geek or a nerd like I do uh, that doesn't mean that uh, you need to be unhealthy uh, so uh, I am getting into a little bit more serious um, exercising and I needed some uh, adjustable weights or I needed weights and I decided to get some adjustable weights uh, and I decided on these the other part of the the other reason really why I wanted to make this particular video is that I haven't really seen a really good video about these uh, adjustable weights. The ones that I've 